Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Um, I just wanted to, this is going to be a, well you already know, it's going to be a Marshalls, Target, Hobby Lobby, and Ross uh, haul. So, <clears throat> anyways, we're just going to get right into it. Welcome back. Um, no Dollar Tree this week. Today I took the day and just, I've Instead of going to the gym or anything like that, I, I fell off the wagon, guys, and uh, I just, it's so hard to get motivated again, so I just went shopping, so anyways, we're going to start with the uh, Target haul. I already have this in the oven, but it was getting kind of that time of the day, and I'm like, oh, I don't have nothing out for supper, so I just put one of these, got one of these uh, lasagnas and I already have it in the oven, and what else, what I say, Target? Got this at Starbucks from Target. That was my last stop. Um, I got orange juice. The kids already went through that orange juice, so I got some more of that uh, Simply Orange orange juice with some pulp in it. And out of paper plates, I get these big, tall uh, stack of paper plates I normally get at Sam's, but, um, you know, I'm out. We used the last one. So I just grabbed some plates to get us by um, until I can get to Sam's. And that'll be another haul in itself. And, oh, I got, um, they have these shirts on sale. Uh, the Morona shirts, the V-neck, like, uh, $9 a piece or two for 16 So, I got two, um, two of these shirts. They're just like that thin kind of material. I don't know. I like them. Anyway, I got black and I got this, um, burgundy maroon, I don't know, color. Anyway, got that. I hope they shrink a little bit. I mean, I kind of like them long when I wear um, my skinny jeans or whatever, but anyways, got two of those. That was um, Target, and I could not find anything in the, uh, the dollar, you know, spot area, so no luck there, but that's it. Just a small little haul from uh, Target, and we'll go ahead and do um, Ross. It's not very big either. Um, I picked up these there. These are the Ghirardelli. I don't even know how to say them, but I love the um, the sea salt uh, kind. These are my favorite. The dark and sea dark chocolate and sea salt with caramel. Oh, it's so good. I already opened it up and ate one. They were starting to get kind of soft, so I need to let them harden back up. And. I picked some of these up because I'm going to start making smoothies again. And I've never used these, but I've seen where people are making smoothies. And they use these in their recipe, like a teaspoon or whatever in it. Because it um, they swell up and they get you a lot, you know, keep you full for a little bit longer. And um, anyway, they're the whole flax seeds. So I thought, I didn't think that was too bad. And they were, um, it was $2.99 for this. And it's a, six, it's a pound. For $2.99, so that was a great deal there. And I seen this, and it's just a, um, a pumpkin hand soap. I do not need hand soaps whatsoever, but it was too cute. So uh, it's Pumpkin Harvest Hand Soap by Morgan Childs, and it's not glass. At first, I thought it was glass. It's plastic, but so cute. And it was uh, $2.99. And I don't remember what else I got. Oh, I needed another, uh, I have a plastic one this size, and all the little, uh, I've had it so long, all the little things have wore off, so I got me a glass one. I have one, another glass one bigger than this and smaller than this, so now I've got this size, and it is, uh, this was $3.99, and it's a Pyrex, so that's really good. Um, and that was all from Ross, that was it. Couldn't find any little cute shirts or nothing there. And then we have, um, I'm trying to hurry, I've got to go down to the bus stop. From, we'll do, uh, what is this? Marshalls. We'll do Marshalls. Look at this, y'all. Oops. Somebody here? I can't even tell. Sorry. Look at this little pumpkin. It's so cute. And it's like, I don't know, I wish you could feel it. It's like, uh, it don't light up or anything, but it's just so, it's just, it's too cute. I'm going to set it, you can't see, but I'm going to set it over there on the bottom of my, uh, my fireplace thingy. So yeah, just love it. And anyways, this was $12.99. It says compare at $20. So, got that. 
And um, I've seen this at the checkout. It's just an OPI color, and it was the things off of it, but it was $2.99 OPI in the color Dark Side of the Moon. It's kind of a grayish, it's got like a bluish hint to it. Really pretty. So that was, yeah, we're on Mars. Hey, I'm doing a haul. I'm about to go get him in just a minute. And I found this at Marshall's the, to put in our refrigerator for the eggs. What was that? Oh. Um, but yeah, it's for your eggs. All I have is like a little plastic thing in there now. And it's just got the little um, thing for a dozen eggs. The acrylic little container for $6.99. Hey, get out of all this. Go. Get out of all that. Get out of all that. Hey, look what I found. Weren't you want more? We gotta be there. Weren't you want one of these? No. Maybe it was dad. Back scrubber. We gotta be there by 645. Okay. In the morning. Okay. Picked up this. Um Okay, as I was saying, um, this is another little plaid shirt that I picked up. And the, the bottom, I like how the bottom is, or the back is um, a lot longer to cover up back there. Um, but anyways, this will look good with some jeans and some boots and stuff like that. So I got that, and that was it at um, Marshall's. I showed you all everything else. Um, I thought this was just too cute though. I already know I already showed you that, but anyway, I'm almost done. So at stop. Okay, I'm gonna need you to splice these two together because I'm not gonna redo the whole thing, okay? I'm I'm where I left I think off. You're going. Huh? I think you're going. You can splice them together for me because I don't know how. Can you do that? Okay, let's get this over with. Um, at Hobby Lobby, I went in. They had um, a sale. You know how they have sales all the time. Like uh, They have like 50% off like um, fall stuff and, some, and Christmas stuff and everything. And then, you know, off of other miscellaneous stuff too. So like all their resin stuff like this. This is kind of like a basket. Well, I have, I collect deer horns or sheds or whatever. And I actually have, I don't know if you can see, um, there's little, the little balls, you know how you put the little balls and like baskets and stuff. Well, they have like the deer um, horn balls that go in here and I have a couple of them. And I never did get this, but they have this on sale. It was half off. So this was like 12 bucks and it's kind of, you know, it's good sturdy, so. It's not real horns, it's resin, but uh, yeah, my little outlets and stuff in the wall are the, uh, the deer horns. <clears throat> and I have, um, was gifted one of these and um, the horn broke off and we've been gluing it back together. It keeps falling off the wall. But um, I mean, yeah, so now I have a pair of them. This was on sale, it was like six bucks, so. And I went down the Christmas aisle and picked up some ornaments to go on our tree. And they are deer horn as well. Um, the resin I picked up, and these are all half off. I picked up this one, little wreath made out of uh, the little deer horns. And then this one that says Joy. And this one says Noel. Just thought those were so cute. And this is the kind of stuff that we put on our tree is like just country stuff and stuff like that. And this one says peace and these were all half off so they were like three bucks so anyway that is it and I'm hoping to splice these uh, <laughs> two together and maybe my son can do it for me but anyways what he was talking about when he came in and just you know uh, you know send your prayers this way he has surgery in the morning it is a shoulder surgery he has a slap tear in the cartilage that surrounds that ball joint or that joint in there and um, 
they're gonna go in like on each side I can't do it here but on each side they're gonna go in and repair that and um, uh, from what I'm understanding, it's going to be like a, you know, a slow healing or whatever. I just, you know, it's, it's an in and out surgery. And, um, but just pray that he doesn't have much pain afterwards and everything. And pray everything goes well. And we thank you. And thanks so much for watching. Thanks to all my subscribers. And until next time, we'll talk to you later. Bye.